In this video, we will show you how to set up a polyacrylamide gel for wet tank transfer in a mini transplant cell. After you have removed your gel from the gel cassette, equilibrate the gel in a tray with transfer buffer for 15 minutes on a rocking platform. Pre-soak blotting paper and fiber pads in the transfer buffer and ensure complete coverage. If using a nitrocellulose membrane, pre-wet the membrane and transfer buffer. If using a PVDF membrane, pre-soak in 100% methanol. To make the blotting sandwich, place the gel holder cassette with the black side down and a tray with sufficient transfer buffer. Place one pre-wet fiber pad onto the black plastic, followed by a pre-wet sheet of blotting paper. Take the gel and carefully place it onto the blotting paper, being careful to avoid trapping excessive air bubbles. Now place your pre-soaked membrane onto the gel. Using a roller, remove any air bubbles between the gel and the membrane to ensure maximum and even protein transfer. Place a second sheet of blotting paper on top of the membrane then the final fiber pad on top to complete the sandwich. Close the gel holder and secure it with the sliding clamp. Insert the gel holder into the inner module. Make sure the black side of the holder faces the black side of the module. Place the module into the transfer chamber. Add a frozen cooling unit and fill the chamber to the appropriate level. Attach the lid and connect the leads to the power supply, red to red and black to black. Set the power supply to appropriate settings, then begin transfer. Mm -hmm. 